Hello everybody, my name is Markiplier, and welcome back to Let's Play the Kerbal Space Program. Okay, you guys asked for more, and here I am. Sorry for the delay on the video today, because I have been trying oh so hard to get the Slender the Arrival Easter Egg glitch level, whatever you want to call it, to work for three hours. I'm not even joking. I tried every single permutation, every single, like, configuration, like... Flashlight, radio first, radio flashlight first, we're going out the garage door, uh, doing it over and over again. I've tried everything and I could not get it to work. I was so frustrated that I just gave up. After three hours of recording straight, I gave up. There's nothing to show for it. It's boring. So, <laughs> we are going to take our frustration out on these poor unsuspecting Kerbals. <laughs> okay, so. I'm going to approach this a bit more scientifically. Basically, I'm going to try to actually get into space. The moon is the next step, but space is the first step. Because we, we have yet to break the atmosphere. So, what we need is obviously more fuel and less weight. Or more thrust, all in general. So, what we need to do is we need to get a lightweight cockpit. This one looks good. It, it has a total mass of 1. This one has 0.8, but... This one seems like it might be a bit more reliable. And it looks cooler anyway. So, as you can see, we need to create a sort of fuel system that is both aerodynamically stable and symmetrical, as well as being really, really awesome. So, first off, let's put a nose cone on this, um, biache. Okay, so we need a linear... That's a thruster, that's not a nose cone. This is a nose cone, so... Oh, that's tiny. Where's the nose cone? Uh, aha! Here we go. This is more like it. Ta-da! Oh, that even matches. That's cool. And then we put this on top. Boop! <laughs> My device is almost comp... Well, it's not even near complete, so I, I shouldn't say that. But it needs an SAS module. Someone told me that I needed to be able to... Actually, let me put the SAS model module in between so that it's got some stability. Yeah! Perfect. Okay. Now, we need a good we need a good ratio of fuel to weight and then ample thrust. So I want the center one to be the maximum thrust, but at the same time I want the other ones to be the primary ignition, like the short burst low fuel ones that break off. <laughs> How I do that, I have no clue, but whatever. I'm not a rocket scientist. Okay, this one seems like it's got a lot of fuel, but it's got more mass, so let's go with this one. It's not as heavy. Seems like it's a good deal. Okay, we'll go with that. And I'm thinking, like, I'm pretty sure you need some sort of, like, there's a bunch of oxidizers and, and who's who, what's it's, and winkly wonkies and uh, other stuff like that. So I need a, need a big thruster, okay. Wait, hang on, let me read this. Yeah, I got enough. Okay, so you got that. And this is looking really bad, but I don't care. It's not exactly aerodynamic. But then again, it don't need to be. <laughs> okay, let's create another one. And apparently it's ba ass backwards, so. <laughs> oh God. What is that? That thing's huge! Good lordy! No, thank you. That would... Well, I guess that's for getting really heavy stuff into space, but... I don't even think this is gonna get me all the way into space. But, I'm not here to argue about that. I'm, I'm just here to... To <laughs> make things explode, frankly. So I don't really care about all of that. Let's try... This one looks like a... Yeah, that looks about right. Okay, so... Ba -da 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 -da. These people are gonna die. Let me actually angle snap this. Yep, that looks better. And right there. All right, so now I need some nice cheap thrusters for those bad boys. Badushki! Raise that up a bit. That's ah, looking like a spaceship, ain't it? Ah! All right, aerodynamicism. Uh, delta wing. Provide high lift and stable center of, center of gravity for every day. Ooh, those are big, too. They're a bit bigger than I'd need, but... Ah, size! Well, ah, maybe I should do something small. Is this smaller? Ah, it's more like it. That's better. That's better. Okay. Boop. 
That's looking more like it. I like it already. I need to move these to number one. And wait, no, that's backwards. Should be in zero. No, I'm a, I'm gonna assume that's correct because it was like it was the other way. Okay, center of thrust, looking good. Center of lift, looking good. Center of mass, right on the money. Right on the center of lift. Oh yeah, it's looking good. Let launch this bad boy into space. Cabo, 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 Cabo. Come on, let's go. All right, who do we got? Bob! Well, uh, you must know what happened to Bill in uh, Jebediah. Jebediah is still somewhere up in the atmosphere. About to burn up, but... Uh, oh, oh, oh. Are we ready to lift off? Oh, 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 oh. Throttling up. Oh, oh, oh. oh, look, Bob's all excited. Oh, 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 oh. Ignition in 10, 9... One! We have liftoff! <laughs> now, I need to make very, very, very steady adjustments on this. Very small. Oh, lordy. No, no. Go the other way. How do I make you go the other way? Stop it! Go the other way. There we go. There we go. A little bit better. A little bit better. A little bit better. No, 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 no. Get back here! Get back here! No! Don't go, Bob! Stop it! What are you doing? Bob! Control your ship! Go up, up, up. These controls don't make any sense. Why? No! I, you, you switch on me. You're switching the controls on me. The gyroscope is not helping. How do I activate the SAS? Okay, SAS has been activated. Where the hell are we going? Holy crap! SAS, help me out here. Okay, primary fuel is almost over. And now the second stage should fire any minute now. Stage, switch stage. How do I switch the stage? Switch the damn stage! Switch the damn stage! There we go, okay. All right, the stage has been switched. Bob looks concerned. Hey, Bob, how you doing there in the bottom left? How you doing? How you doing there? Hi, Bob. Hi, Bob. Don't be worried. I'm... I have a bad feeling that this rocket is not doing nearly enough thrust. And we're not even going up anymore, so, uh... Just hold on there, Bob. Let me turn off SAS and get some... No! Not that way! Now turn SAS back on! I should have had SAS back on from the beginning. Turn it off. Turn it on. I don't know. Bob, I don't know. We're going up. We're going down. I'm trying to get it back into normal up, but it's not cooperating! Why are you going that way?! I'm I'm hitting I'm not this is bad 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 no 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 Bob <laughs> I killed Bob No <laughs> Why does it suck so much Oh Oh Bob Kirby was killed Oh no Oh no! Oh well, all right. Let's go uh, back to the drawing board here. Obviously the center one is not nearly enough lift, apparently. It needs much mucho more lifto. So, let's see here. Um, let's get a different symmetry mode going here for the primary engines. Now let's take this out of here, because that didn't work at all. That SAS module is she. Okay, so. This one is chock full of jet fuel. Uh, let's see here. These are small. They're liquid fuel. But they also these also have oxidized. All right, you know what? Screw it. Let's go for size over quality. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, God. Uh, actually, let's not do that. Let's um, just put a fuel tank there. And now we put these on the sides. I think it won't even fit. Oh, my God. Yes, it will. Oh, my God. No. No. Holy crap. No. 
Oh my god! It actually works? No! This is a bad idea! But I want to do it! Let's get some, uh, you know, stability aerodynamics. Now I can use these big ones. <laughs> oh no! I feel so bad for the next person to go in here. Let's do it! Oh my god! <laughs> Mitten! Mitten Kerman! I'm so sorry, Mitten! Throttle up! SAS on! Flubuski! Oh! <laughs> oh no! <laughs> No! God damn it! It was too much power! It was unstable! Oh no! They The fuel tanks collided into each other. Structural failage on liquids between Rocco Max fuel tank and Rocco Max fuel tank. Oh god, no! Okay, take that out of there. Okay, it was this. This couldn't hold. This couldn't handle. All of the, uh, <laughs> all of the power. Let's try that again, but, uh, with less failure. Okay, let's try smaller outside engines. Oh, we're gonna have a lot of thrust this time. Oh, my God, that was so damn funny. I, I, <laughs> that was so damn funny. And I know it shouldn't be because it was really sad or something, but whatever. It was, to me... That was so damn funny. Okay, we're gonna try to keep the center of thrust relatively even. All right, aerodynamics is get these nice and actually let's put these on the inside. No, the outside, no, the inside. Inside, outside, outside. Boop. Yeah, it looks good. Wait, no, I don't want those. I want, I want, I don't want fins that. Yeah, these are, yeah, that's what I like, I think. I'm not sure. Those don't even go on there. Okay, never mind. Standard, whatever. Just do it. It's gonna blow up anyway. I don't even know why I'm bothering to try. Let's do it. Hey, raise the roof. All right, SAS Danzer Kerman. Uh, don't mind what happened to the last guys. The SAS module is on. Okay. All right. All right. Here we go. That looks pretty good. That's pretty good. Doing pretty good. I'm hoping that the SAS module will keep you relatively stable, steady. It seems to be doing pretty good. So, uh, ah, don't look so scared, Dancer. You're doing better than. Why are they wobbling? Why are they wobbling? Why are they wobbling? Why are they wobbling? Dancer, you should be scared when things wobble. That's bad. Alright, I guess we're okay. Relatively. That is not a good thing. Now the engines are starting to wobble. <laughs> this looks so bad. Oh no, we're running out of fuel. Oh no. What are we gonna do? Okay, the wobbling is settling. And... Fuel gone. All right, looking good. All right, are we in space? Are we in space yet? I don't think we are. Um, I would be very scared, Mr. Kerman, because <laughs> we seem to be losing altitude very quickly. What happened to the fuel on the center fuel tank? Did I need to link those up somehow with, like, other stuff? <laughs> I don't know. Time to go out! Grab on! Oh, he made it. <laughs> Grab. Okay, he's grabbing on. <laughs> oh, that's so funny. <laughs> he's grabbing onto the spaceship. Oh, he's still doomed. <laughs> he's doomed. <laughs> he's doomed. Okay. All right, he's falling now. Abort! Abort! <laughs> Abort the mission! Abort, little buddy! Abort! Don't let go! Don't let go! Uh-oh. Things seem to be tilting. Okay, I'm gonna... 
I'm going to doom him to a fate worse than death. As you're going to go out. And now, oh, ugh, uh, oh, no. Oh, no. I can't watch. No, he's falling. Felix von Birkenberg, whatever the guy, the Red Bull guy that fell out of the sky. Oh, no. It's so damn funny. He's got this somber look of acceptance on his face. No, he's screaming. No, he, he's, pre he's pretty upset. He looks pretty upset. I shouldn't find this as funny as I do, but it's just for some reason. This is so mean. But after what I went through trying to get Slender the Arrival to Easter Egg work, all right, let's not, let's, let's not watch this. Let's just end the flight. Uh, yeah, let's, uh, let's not do that. Let's not do that. Okay, we're gonna go, we're gonna get this some bitch in space. These wings, they just get in the way. All right, you know what? I'm tired of messing around here. We're gonna get a huge center tank with a huge, no, give me a huge center lifter doodaddy thingy. We're gonna get big old fat ones with in uh, lots of symmetry modes like that. So we got high thrust and then we got low thrust. And I think working together, that's pretty good. I think together they're gonna be, you know, pretty, pretty stable, pretty stable. Tail fin. Yeah, I'll be good. Okay. All right, we're good to go. All right. Now, before this thing can even fall over, because it doesn't look too steady there, looks a little top heavy there. Hey, Dancer. Welcome back. If that is you. Here we go. Yeah. We're going to space. Yeah. Yeah. Overheat. That doesn't sound good. But I mean, what's the worst that could happen, right? What's the worst that could happen? Huh? What happened? Did we lose an engine? I think we lost an engine. Yeah, the whole rocket came off. Well, this isn't gonna make it into space, so... Let's just take a Oh, the SAS is keeping us pretty stable. I can't even... I can't even intentionally turn it that hard. It's very, very stable. Huh. I guess having thrust more to the top of the center of mass is good. Well, lesson learned. Let's just try to rock the... Sorry, Danzer. You're an experiment into failure here. Ah, there we go. That's better. Yeah, that's better. Oh, no. Oh, what? Oh, what? 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 Oh, what? Oh, what? Oh, what? 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 Okay, we're done. I'm not gonna watch you die. We're done. That, this went horribly awry. This went horribly awry, so... I'm still learning! I'm still learning. One of these days, I'm gonna get this into space. But for now, I'll accept failure. Funny, funny, funny failure. <laughs> so, thank you all so much for watching. Click the annotations for more videos than I've done. And as always, I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye! Ah!